In this video, we'll demonstrate Multiplicity's dynamic processing abilities in more depth. We'll be working on this drum bus, showing various applications and innovations of the plugin. I'll start out with this five band crossover preset to get the plugin pushing some audio around, and I'll move the frequency bands to something a bit more appropriate for the kit. Settings displayed in yellow are linked across all bands, so the ratio can be increased for some more extreme compression across the frequency spectrum, or backed off a little bit. The attack parameter controls how we want the gain change to be applied when moving away from zero. Slower attacks let short peaks through. These are the transients. Setting a slow attack time, I can tell the processing to hold off and let transients through. The parts of the signal which the attack parameter is fast enough to respond to, we call dynamics. So, dynamics and transients. I'll hit diff here to audition the changes that the plugin's making to the audio. Then slide between dynamic and transient material. To let through longer transients, I can make the attack slower still. I'll turn diff off, and we can listen to the difference between transients and dynamics. Since transients are all the material slipping through a slow attack time, they obey an attack and release time determined by the look-ahead parameter. Shorter look-ahead times allow playing with transients quite aggressively and can introduce more distortion, whereas longer times tend to provide smoother gain reduction. Let's say we want to expand the high mids of the drum bus and really make that snare smack through. I'll unlink the band, set the ratio to some moderate expansion, and then focus on the transient material. Remember, there are up to eight bands to play around with, so perhaps I'll back off the low end slightly and apply this dynamic EQ band after all the other processing. Auto gain automatically compensates for any perceived gain change between the input and output levels. Let's also crossfade to about half the processed signal, since this is our main drum bus. And here's the finished thing, with some basic multiplicity magic on it. Nothing's as useful as trying out the beast for yourself, so grab a free demo from the DMG site now. Thanks for watching.